Good morning, Kaufman. Today is a very special day in our country. It is Veterans Day. It's our chance to honor some of the most special people America has ever produced. It takes a remarkable person to be a military veteran. We are grateful for their service, but very few of us truly know what is sacrificed by those who fight for our country. Veterans go to battle in foreign lands, are separated from their loved ones, and many have paid the ultimate sacrifice. We have three Kaufman staff members who are veterans. Mr. Bo Cunningham served in the National Guard, Mr. Chris Hamilton served in the U.S. Navy, and Ms. Tammy Aquino served in the U.S. Army. Mr. Cunningham is still serving our country. Please give us a few minutes at this time. Put your homework and electronics devices away. To honor our veterans, Mr. Cunningham and Mr. Hamilton explain to you what life is like in our country's armed services. I am a major in the Ohio Air National Guard. Uh, I currently am uh, the squadron commander of the 179th Maintenance Squadron. My uncle was in the Air Force, my dad was drafted in, in the Korean War, and my brother served in the Marine Corps. I've gone to uh, Germany, a part of Operation Joint Forge. Uh, I've been to Iraq as part of Iraqi Freedom, and I've also deployed uh, a while ago, uh, I, I deployed to Kuwait uh, as a part of uh, Operation Enduring Freedom. It was during our time when uh, they blew up the Marine barracks in 83, and we were doing patrols off the coast of Israel. I've worked in aircraft maintenance, so generally maintenance operations occur in fairly safe locations. So probably the most dangerous location was being in Iraq. Uh, there was active fighting going on, uh, but we were, we were isolated from that. I mean to be able to share time with other veterans that have served. There was a lot of, you know, there was a lot of riding on that deployment and it was my first deployment where uh, I was leading maintenance operations. Uh, and to have a success rate, I mean, we were like 97% uh, mission capable, which means we were able to go uh, most of the time. We, all, you know, we, we didn't miss many missions. I just knew I'm a proud veteran. Try to imagine yourself serving as these men did. Think about what would be going through your mind if you were enlisted. Kaufman students explain why Veterans Day is so important to them. Uh, my uncle's in the Special Forces and uh, my grandpa was uh, part of the Army and uh, it's just a really special day. Uh, I'm going to be going to the Air Force Academy and I just think it's really great to honor like the people that have served us. We wouldn't be here right now if it, if it weren't for them. Veterans Day means a lot to me because these people risk their lives every day. I think to me Veterans Day means honoring those who have risked our lives to save our country. It's a very important day that I think everyone should recognize and give thanks to the veterans. Veterans Day is an important part of American culture, honoring those who serve to protect our liberties, our lives, and most of all, our freedom. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. When you have some quiet time later, try to envision how many American veterans are in our country's history. The number is staggering, but the lives lost and changed due to American military services is impossible to calculate. Never forget that the United States would not be the country we love today without all of the sacrifices of these brave men and women that have the honor of being called veterans. Please take a few minutes today to thank Kaufman veterans, Mr. Hamilton, Mr. Cunningham, and Ms. Aquino when you see them in the halls. If you know any veterans, to be sure to send them a message or call them and thank them for their service today. Happy Veterans Day.